Hello, what's up and welcome to the channel. In this video guys, we're going to talk about CMU 1.12.1, the new release for the CMU Wii emulator. And uh, we're going to talk about the futures, uh, how good it ha if we have, if we're going to get some uh, performance imp uh, improvements and if we're going to see some compatibilities uh, with the new build. With anything further to do, let's hop to my desktop and see what is going on. Alright guys, welcome back. This is the site here, here where I, we're going to watch and see uh, some game footage from Reznor. I think it's his name. If I pronounce it wrong, I'm sorry, dude. But, uh, uh, well, anyway, all supports, guys, of course, when we play in the, the, the video, uh, the, yeah, the videos uh, goes to him. Reznor, I'm going to put the link in the description below where you can go actually to his YouTube channel because it's his footage, not mine. But when you, let's read actually here. There's the news. Semi 1. Point, uh, as, as I thought, guys, Semi 1.12.1 uh, is now available. Future mineral compatibility, compatibility improvements and tones of bug fixes. That's for. And by that, guys, uh, that is it's what they mean is available. It's only available it's right now for Patreons only. The public release is going to be one week from now on. Uh, might, might be May 1st, if I'm not wrong. Anyway, let's keep reading here. The team behind the best Wii U emulator, Simu, has released a brand new version of, of it. According to the release notes, Simu 1.12.1 comes with a minor compatibility improvement in tons of bug fixes, miscellaneous improvements. Um, furthermore, Simu 1 brings general control and at native Wii U improvements. That means that you can use the Wii U uh, control, the motion Wii U controller, if I'm not wrong, and add support for USB device via pass through. I don't know about that, but it ha obviously you can use. I mean, I think the hardware of the Wii U, the actual Wii U, F, uh, on the Simu emulator. This new version of Simu is currently available f to all Patreon. Patreon, as I told you before, guys, five dollar a month, and you have access to it right now. Otherwise, you have to wait to the June 1st. Sorry, guys, I mean June, not May. June 1st, and it will be available before the public. Um, below, you can find its full release notes as well as some videos showing a couple of games of running. All right, they mean those kinds. And I'm not really like uh, interested in uh, Super Mario 3D World because it already runs uh, at um, at, six, at locked 60 FPS with the highest. Um, Resolution uh, available right now and it's 4K, so I don't know why we would watch it. What I'm really interested in is actually um, Pokemon Tournament, what we're gonna watch right now and see how the performance is. Um, oh, holy crap, okay, let's go down a little bit. As you might hear, the audio, the audio is bad. Okay. Um, from, from what I'm hearing, the the audio quality is not quite there, but the gameplay is fluid. I don't see any glitches for right now. No, but this but the sound is not quite there, so it's still we still need some improvement. As you might hear, let I let you hear right now. When it, when it goes to the game audio, yes, it's fully there. But when the when the girl when when the girl is talking, the M NPC, right? Then you hear like a quiet, a glitchy, and the music as well in the background. Let's skip. No, all right. So. Uh, a Pokemon tournament is not quite there. If it goes to the performance, I think it's uh, it's all there. I cannot complain about the performance and whatnot. But when it goes to the audio, it's not quite there. It needs still some improvements. I think it's um, it's like around 60, 70 percent when it goes to sound. Like, but with gameplay and whatnot, it's all smooth and dandy. And if you don't care about sound, you just can't uh, silent it, and uh, you're good to go actually. Now Xenoblade Chronicles, I know it works fine uh, with the latest with the latest build that we have uh, so far. That is Simu 1.12.0, and uh, 
and uh, we get actually stable frames but what most, what's more interesting is guys we have here Tokyo Mirage season um, what is actually uh, exclusive for the Wii U and uh, I don't know if you don't if you don't know with the latest with the latest build that we have right now that I used the 1.12.0 we actually get it running but when you go to the when you come to the gameplay it's actually uh, it's a glitchy and it's actually you lose control you cannot let progress from 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 this point on uh, which I'm gonna show you but um, with the new release 1.12.1 we actually have now uh, a full playable uh, game what is actually a really great game let's watch it and I'm gonna hide but I think okay, the sounds all up there okay the audio is not as high as I want to I don't know why can I okay now the sound is good I cannot complain gameplay looks fine to me and I I, I, t I tell you like would you run it on the on the other on the other uh, build you would see only a bunch of mess glitchy things it doesn't run you lose the control you, you don't have any control of it um, so uh, as as it goes um, to the gameplay and now look at that amazing just amazing I'm uh, quite impressed and I, I think we will see as well some uh, FPS improvements when it goes to uh, Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild obviously and the most of you guys are actually interested in um, Breath of the Wild. Most of the, of the people like actually the simulator for Breath of the Wild and whatnot. Me especially as well. But it runs not bad for me. It runs at 60, 50 frames. As you might see, smooth, no glitches. Um, Alright, we had there a little bit of lag and whatnot. But other than that. It's not bad and I want uh, really to go to YouTube and just tell you guys go uh, go and support raise more I think he is the owner of the CMU product a uh, project a uh, product I don't know you know what I mean guys right that he is he is the developer I think I'm not I'm not quite sure but I think he is the developer he uh, he does work with the CMU team and uh, making this great work so uh, support goes to him when it goes for the game footage and whatnot. I'm gonna keep the uh, link in the description below where you can go to his channel and uh, get the latest updates on what's going on, releases and whatnot. Um, let me uh, really quick get out of here. Let me do this. So uh, I think, I, of course, I just want to read this real quick. Here you have some. Uh, if you if you like, can, uh, like want to know. Uh, what's going on what what kind of improvements we have and you can see it right here you can read it for yourself as well uh general upgrades you know that kind of information and whatnot what has been fixed updated and uh, improved um but all in all i think i'm quite impressed with um with the with with this new build and uh as soon as I get my hands on, I will do a full build and how to uh, customize and improve it and whatnot for the all kinds of games. Uh, like the video, like like it if you like it, dislike it if you didn't, and um, subscribe to the channel. My, my name my name is Emu from Emu Gaming, and uh, I'm freaking out of here. Peace.